Hello everyone, Mike Starks with Remax Town & Country here. Today we're looking at 307 South Creek. Really an excellent investment opportunity for somebody. The property is affectionately known as the Agarita House and Agarita Outback. So you've technically got two bed and breakfast short-term rental units here located just south of Fredericksburg, which are both just cute as a button and turnkey operation, uh, selling almost completely furnished. So let me show you where we are. That's downtown Fredericksburg, like Market Square. Uh, from Main Street, you just head south on Elk, and Elk kind of turns into South Creek. So about five blocks south of Main, you're at the property. I was just standing in front of the Agarita house here. Big lot, 0.33 acres. And then the Agarita house out back, you can barely see because it's covered up by that huge oak tree. You've got the concrete drive, circle drive, that brings you in and out of the property. And like I said, really great location. You could be downtown in two minutes. So let's go in and take a look around. We'll start off with the Agarita house. Originally built in 1930. It offers three bedrooms, two baths, and really just cute as a button. Got these old wood floors in here. Nice big living area. Living room's 15 by 15. Dining area is 9 by 15. And I just love the way that it's such an authentic feel in here. You still have the wooden door frames, old doors. Really a great, fun place for people to stay. And this property is zoned R2, which gives you a lot of flexibility. You can have multiple B&Bs on this property, which is kind of hard to find around Fredericksburg. Uh, but it also gives you the ability, I mean, like if you wanted to live in this house and rent the back when you could, you can rent both. Uh, yeah, really, uh, you can rent one for like long-term rentals and rent the other for short-term rentals. Just a lot of flexibility on this property. Third bedroom. Another good-sized bedroom, 13 by 15. do be paying attention to all the furnishings here because like I was saying uh, this property is being sold pretty much turnkey there's a few items that won't convey and I have a list of those um, available but by and large pretty much everything you're seeing here is going to go with the property so you can buy and just immediately transition into renting it yourself great old kitchen love that old farmhouse sink that's still in place second three-quarter bath. I love these brick floors in the back here and in that other bathroom. You also have a little basement. We won't go down there. It's full of Christmas decorations right now, but it'd really make a great wine cellar. Then you walk out back. Each of the units have a private little setting area with a hot tub, fire pit. The storage building is set up with the laundry room and uh, it's a great place so you can have all your extra linens and everything out of the house. And then you couldn't see it from the aerial because of that big oak tree, but that is the Agarita Outback. And I remember when these folks bought this property, that was just an old fallen down barn and they've done a great job restoring it. I mean, it's. They, they raised the, the complete barn up off the ground, poured a foundation, um, did electrical plumbing. It's a, basically a new house built out of old material. Again, there's a good shot of just how big this lot is, even with both of these homes on it. Look at that tree. Awesome. 
Let's go in and look around here as well. The Outback offers two bedrooms, one bath. But again, really a great feeling, a little place. Lots, really a fun place. Stained concrete floors in here. Kind of a small kitchenette area, living room. And most of the furnishings will convey in here as well. You've got the loft, which I'll go take a look at in a second. Big bedroom down here that leads to the outside. Now this bedroom's like 20 by 11, so I mean, it's a really nice big bedroom. You've got the main bath, again, walk-in shower. Very well done. I love that old wine barrel that's been made into the sink. And then let's run upstairs. So I just came up the stairs, you got this other loft area for the second bedroom. And plenty spacious, 12 by 13. Now I've just come back down stairs to the bedroom, just so I could walk out and kind of show you. It also has its own private setting area with the hot tub, fire pit. So if you've been looking for a great investment opportunity, short-term rental, uh, place to live with a short-term rental, like I was saying, a lot of flexibility on this property. If you'd like more information, you can visit my site at www.mikestarks.com. And thanks for watching.